Robert Boyd of Kilmarnock is a significant figure in Scottish history, particularly for his role as a close ally of Robert the Bruce during the Scottish Wars of Independence. Boyd's contributions to the struggle for Scottish independence, as well as his position as a powerful lord and advisor to the Scottish Crown, make him an important figure in Scottish politics and culture. Boyd was born in the late 13th century in the area around Kilmarnock in Ayrshire, Scotland. He came from a family with a long history of involvement in Scottish politics and warfare, and his father had been a supporter of William Wallace in the earlier stages of the Scottish Wars of Independence. Robert Boyd first appears in historical records in the 1290s, when he served as a witness to a number of charters in the Ayrshire region. In 1306, he became a close ally of Robert the Bruce, who was then fighting to secure the Scottish throne. Boyd's support for Bruce was significant, as it helped to solidify Bruce's claim to the throne and gave him a powerful ally in the Ayrshire region. During the Wars of Independence, Boyd fought alongside Bruce in a number of battles, including the Battle of Bannockburn in 1314. He was also instrumental in securing a peace treaty with England in 1323, which allowed Scotland to maintain its independence and regain control of a number of key territories. After the Wars of Independence, Boyd became a powerful lord and advisor to the Scottish Crown. He was granted a number of lands and titles, and he served as an ambassador and negotiator for the Scottish King. Boyd was also involved in a number of feuds and conflicts with rival clans, particularly the Montgomerys and the Hamiltons. Today, Robert Boyd of Kilmarnock is remembered as a key figure in the Scottish Wars of Independence and a powerful lord and advisor to the Scottish Crown. His support for Robert the Bruce and his contributions to Scottish politics and culture have left a lasting legacy, and his story is a fascinating reminder of the struggle for Scottish independence and the important role played by individual figures in shaping Scotland's history.